This past weekend, we were in the swimming community gathering memories of the late Penny McDowell. And as you can see and you'll hear, many remembered her fondly. Let's take a look. For those of you that weren't here last night, this is the first weekend and the first couple meets that we've had where we're missing a great presence from K-Man Swimming. Um, Miss Penny passed on this week, and I think her presence was, was very much noticed last night, and I'm sure will be noticed again this morning. As Stingray head coach David Persley addressed the swimming community Saturday, his sentiments echo those of so many. Penny McDowell changed the way we think about the intellectually disabled. I would go into things and maybe make assumptions about abilities or what people could handle as far as interactions are concerned. And then you watch Penny and she treats every single person, treated every person she came across with the same respect, with the same expectations, no matter any station in life, no matter where they came from. Pushing K-Man Special Olympians to reach past their limits. She was in their face. She was just up and down the pool shouting, you know, expecting them to do things that most people might have not even think they were able to do. And I think that show was a big testament in the way that those kids performed. Over at the Commando Bay Sports Complex, K-Man Special Olympians swim team continued their training with heavy hearts. But Penny McDowell didn't just train great swimmers. She mentored those around her to become better people. She was just so self selfless and gave me an opportunity to help coach. It was probably one of the best things that's ever happened to me in my life. As far as, I mean, I've worked with Olympians in the U.S. and all over, but this um, gave me a different type of structure and to work with someone who was so dedicated and passionate about what she did. Good morning. Good morning. <laughs> and Cayman Special Olympians will continue to hear her voice as the road to Abu Dhabi in March continues. Every time I like do something wrong, she's like head down, head down, and she's yelling. I can hear her over everyone. She's just a strong lady, and I'll remember her forever. Leaving behind many special bonds. I describe my parent as my BFF. She calls me Fred. And a legacy like no other. It's going to be hard for a little while, but I honestly believe that the impact she left is going to be lasting and forever. I know, I know it will be in my heart, for sure.